Well, I guess we all need a reason to celebrate now and again, and I am delighted to tell you that uh, just coming up on the 17th of April, it is World Malbec Day. Now, it's nonsense of course, it's marketing spin, there's a proliferation of these crazy days from cheese day to, I don't know, soap day, uh, but the 17th of April is indeed World Malbec Day, so who am I to argue, who am I to spoil the fun, I'm recommending this week a Malbec. My wine comes from Argentina. It is the Trapiche Pure Malbec 2013 and it's priced at £8.99 in the cooperative. Now, uh, the pure refers to the fact that this is an unoaked wine. Normally Malbec, or not normally, but often Malbec uh, is aged in oak casks to give it that extra kind of creaminess, that almost Bordeaux-like cedary quality too in the better wines. But this one, a pure expression, uh, it hasn't seen any oak, and from the 2013 vintage in Mendoza in Argentina, which I guess has become the kind of epicentre of Malbec for the world. It originates down in Caor in the southwest of France where they still make some terrific Malbecs, but Argentina has really Really become the other dominant world force. This example you can possibly see the stunning kind of purple colour of the wine, a really intense youthful purple colour. And on the nose it has a lovely bit of that kind of um, floral aspect that Malbec often has. There's a kind of peppery, ashy lift to this. It's not so much about deep, dark fruit, but something a little bit more bright, a little bit more kind of elevated in tone. Now, there is blackberry fruit there, but it has those lighter notes coming through quite nicely. On the palate, It's very bold and crunchy. Um, this is definitely a food Malbec, I think, you know, because the oak hasn't creamed and softened those edges. There's quite a firm core to this. A lot of juiciness, a lot of plum and cherry juiciness to this wine. Uh, but it's pretty ferocious in terms of the tannins. It has a real bit of grip and structure. You can maybe see the legs here showing the alcohol too. A pretty big wine and in its unadorned, unoaked state, that structure, that kind of uh, quality, that forcefulness really comes through. But you know, not without charm. It still has that cherry brightness to the fruit, nice acidity, and matched to a juicy steak, maybe a piece of lamb grilled, this would be terrific. It is pure Malbec, and a very nice example with which to celebrate World Malbec Day. So my wine of the week is the Trapiche Pure Malbec 2013. It comes from Mendoza in Argentina, and it's on sale in the cooperative stores at £8.99 per bottle. This is my wine of the week. Happy World Malbec Day. Oh.